guys, it's me Sarah. Welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing a back to school makeup routine. As you can see, this is what it looks like. So I really hope you guys enjoy this video. Please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. We are so close to 100 subscribers. So please subscribe. And if you have subscribed, thank you so much. I appreciate it. You have no idea. It means so much to me. Thank you. So subscribe if you haven't. Yeah, let's just get right into the video. Hello guys. But I just washed my face. Now I'm going to take this Hemp's. I have no idea if I'm saying that right, but that's what that is. It's like this hydrating facial toner slash like refresher. Hydrate my skin. So I'm just gonna shake it a little bit and I'm going to spray my face. This feels so good. And I just take my hands and I just like really pat it into my skin. Oh wait, I actually have face roller. I totally forgot that I had it. And I roll it onto my skin. It's, a, it's supposed to be cold, so you have to like put it in the fridge to like make it cold so it stays cold. Or like the freezer or something, I don't know. My skin, so it gets all up in there. I am not a professional, like, like with skincare and stuff. Like, I could be doing this all wrong, so like, don't judge me, okay? Don't judge me. But my acne during like COVID was like the worst it, it, it ever been. So like, I really think that the CeraVe face wash really helped me because it's for my skin type. This, um, I, I think it's called Nicinamide. Nicinamide, I could be butchering that name for all, I don't know. But it's the Ordinary Nicinamide. It's like a serum. Do I know what it does? No. <laughs> but we're gonna use it. So it looks like this and it like drops like that. And I'm going to just, I'm not gonna put this all over my face. I'm just gonna put it on like my T-zone. Tap, 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 tap. Normally when I'm doing like my skincare, like getting ready and stuff, I have like music on and stuff. So it's like so weird to be doing this with no music on. I'm just gonna let that settle into my skin before I put anything else on my skin. Then my last step of my skincare routine is obviously to moisturize. I have no idea where this moisturizer is from. Um, I think I showed you guys this when I was doing my Harry Styles video, getting ready for Harry Styles concert. It's ROC clinically proven moisturizer. I don't really know. It's to moisturize my neck, but I really like it though. It's, it makes me look shiny. Make sure you always moisturize your neck. I think that's very important. You, obviously you're not putting makeup on your neck, but it like prevents wrinkles, so. I just rub it, and I'm gonna tap it. Always tap, try not to rub, because again, if you rub it like, can you know, you're more likely to have wrinkles. I think that's what that means. It started with the makeup, but first let this, you know, settle on my skin. I'm to take my Aquaphor, my bestie, my bestie, till the day I die. Lips, but the cap is broken, so don't judge the way I put this on, because this is what I do. I love this stuff. Now, the moment you have all been waiting for. It's time to go from a solid four, five, to a 10 out of 10. Let's get right into it. Okay. So I really don't do anything with my eyebrows because like one, I really don't know how to do them. And yeah, so we're just gonna brush them. I don't wanna like mess them up and I feel like they look fine the way they are. It's a very like natural kind of makeup look. It's, I don't have that much time in the morning to be doing like a whole like full face of makeup. This back to school routine is my everyday kind of routine if I wore makeup every day. I don't really don't wear makeup every single day. Makeup, I love doing my makeup. It's like kind of therapeutic to me. I'm going to take my concealer. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Cool Ivory, because I'm very pale. Um, I do not use foundation because I just feel like the 
it's too cakey for me like and it i hello can never find like a foundation that like doesn't feel heavy on my skin like i feel like I don't know, I just don't like the way foundation feels on my skin. Like it feels very heavy. So I just use concealer and it, it works fine. I'm just gonna take this concealer and put it on my under eyes because I also have very dark under eyes. So this is what I do. I go in the inner corner of my eye and then I just go to the outer corner like that. Like that. And then I'm just gonna put it on any blemishes that I have. Concealer is on. I'm going to take my Beauty Blender. And I'm going to take my Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. And I'm going to spray my Beauty Blender. And I'm going to squeeze it a little bit. And I'm going to blend out my concealer. Now, I just said to you, I do not use foundation. So I have this L'Oreal Paris Invaluable 24 Hour Fresh Wear Foundation in a powder. So I just use this as like the setting powder for my concealer because I don't use it as a foundation, but I take this other beauty blender and I just, just set everywhere I put the concealer. Like, I just look so sly. This, most of the stuff that I'm using is drugstore stuff and it's cheap. I'm going to do some bronzer. Um, I definitely need for my pale self. So I use this e.l.f. bronzer. It's in the shade Forever Sunkissed. It smells so good. And it looks like this. Comes in this packaging. Again, e.l.f. is a drugstore brand. Is it a drugstore? I don't know, but it's cheap. I'm going to take this e.l.f. bronzer brush. I just put it on my cheekbones. And as you can tell, this looks very, very orange on my skin because I'm so pale. But don't worry, trust the process. It's not going to look like that. Okay, I had a little brief intermission, but we're back. Now it is time for blush. I just finished doing my bronzer. I put it on my forehead and on my cheekbones and a little bit on my neck. Now I'm gonna take this Morphe 2 Wonder Tint Cheek and the Lip Mousse in the shade Amaze but I'm not gonna use it for my lips. I'm going to use it for my cheeks. And I'm gonna tap, tap, tap. I think I'm gonna, so look how cute. Now we're all blushed out, but I have to put some on my nose. Now, one of my favorite parts of my makeup routine, it's highlighter time. I'm using the Maybelline New York Master Chrome is there a name for this? Oh, Molten Gold. And it looks like this. Love this stuff. And I'm going to take my broken Jeffree Star brush, literally broke, and I'm going to tap, tap, tap. And I'm going to look at that. That I freaking, freaking love this stuff. Oh, just so gorgeous. So gorgeous. So gorgeous. Gorgeous. Those. For my inner corner, I like to do something different. Take this ColourPop um, Dis Disney Designer Collection. Looks like this. I'm going to take this shade called Prince Charming. This one right here. It's like really bright, like really bright. I'm just gonna take a little brush and I'm going to put this shade in my inner corner. Are we ready for this? Like, are you kidding? And I just love this palette, it's so cute. It is mascara time, but I'm just gonna curl my lashes. Then I'm going to take this Lancome, uh, it's like a primer for my mascara. And I'm just gonna prime my lashes. Just the thing with my lashes is like, yeah, they're long, but they're not really curled and the, they're like straight so this primer really helps it like stay curled i'm going to take this maybelline maybelline lash sensational mascara and it's like a smaller version this wand is very thick i'm just gonna go mascara. like wow just wow 
then for my lower lashes i hate putting mascara on my lower lashes though for real i take this mascara it's a uh where is this from oh it's from it cosmetics it's like a thin brush it's like literally made for putting it on your lower lashes this is basically what i do like this is what my makeup looks like every single day also might put on like some fake freckles here and there because i think they're so cute so we're gonna do that today so i'm gonna take this soft glam palette from anastasia uh this brown shade called rustic race tap it i'm just gonna dot it like this just like all over my face like legit all over my face now i'm gonna take where's my purple beauty blender i'm just gonna tap it all in so it doesn't look crazy if i were to do lipstick i'd probably take this like mac one oh maybe not this one this is like actually This is MAC in the shade She Share. She Sheer. She Sheer. I don't even know if you can see that. But yeah, that is my makeup routine. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully, hopefully you got some cute makeup tips from my video. But uh, I hope you enjoyed and I will see you guys in my next video. And don't forget to subscribe. Of course, don't forget. You know. Bye guys.